Hey everybody, it's me here, Professor Zack, and I am back with more Yakuza Like a Dragon. Please like, share, and subscribe, and hit up perspective discussions, and as well as a nice ship band of all podcasts and platforms. As well, oh, that was a nice kick. And please donate to us, links in the description below. And yeah, that battle didn't last long at all. <laughs> but thank you for tuning in, everybody. Uh, holy fuck. Holy fuck is indeed right. I saw you in line at Hello Work. Yeah. I don't remember what it was. Matsuo, right? Hmm. What's it to you? Listen, buddy. You didn't really think they'd give you a million yen, did you? Just for trashing a place? Right. You think they were scamming me? I'm you pretty sure they were. Anything else from the Korean mafia? You do know that's who hired you, right? Uh, yeah. Makes you say that. They're the only ones who would want that bar messed up in the first place. Look, we're trying to help you. There's no way in hell they're gonna pay a million to some drunk bum. Honestly. <laughs> like you're an expert. Hey, God what do you look like? The guy who asked I mean, I am a this. bum after all. Did you see his face? Uh, I don't know. Can't remember. Come on, we're not fucking around. Cut it out, Namba. <laughs> if you really want to know, ask the bitch. Bitch. What? Oh. Oh. Arrows. Wait. Ichiba, don't chase him. Nah. They'll kill you if you go on their turf. Yeah, put you out in the open. Did you see that? He was smiling. Yeah. I'm starting to think he wasn't hired by the Komi Jewel. No way. He is one. He was a member. Shit. This is going from bad to worse. I'm still stuck on the bitch thing. You think there's a woman in the Comey Jewel? Might be the How leader. I know? Anyone could be a bitch these days. True, it is a gender neutral term these days. Hey, look. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah, we should probably find somewhere to hide. <laughs> like now. Run! I mean, thank God they're like the worst shots ever, but still. We're sitting ducks. What are we gonna do? Okay, it's all or nothing. What are we gonna do, Ichi? Hey, call me Joel. Hey, what are you doing? It doesn't matter to me one bit if that guy was one of your own, which is the clueless bum. But you have him back now. Then why not let us go? And you won't have our bodies to dispose of. What you and I both know is a huge pain in the ass. Would you stop? Kinda is, though. By the way, you know your little power cable? We cut it because it was like tying a noose around that poor bar's neck. If you hang no. him with it and they close down, you won't be getting that power anyway. So you need to give it up. You're the oh, one who needs to give up. Look, you guys are real ass mafia, right? You shouldn't be doing small time shit like stealing electricity. So cut it out. Fine. I don't care anymore. <laughs> You're dead. Yeah. I'm glad you realize that. <laughs> Are you satisfied? Hmm. Interesting. What? No way. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Thanks, guys. Hey, we're good here. Come on. Is this guy for real? It worked, didn't it? It did work. To be fair, it most definitely worked. Granted, obviously that won't work in real life, but still. <laughs> Welcome back. Hmm? Huh? <laughs> Guess they didn't want to mess with our hired guns. You really saved me. I can't believe you already took care of it. Uh, yeah, 
I mean, I guess it's taken care of? Question mark? Hold on. Yeah, literally, he said that. Hold on. Why do you two think it's all settled? We just got a phone call. Probably from the man who was just here. Huh? Huh? You mean Matsuo? He called? Hi. Yeah, he said sorry about earlier. Just leave the cable how it is. Weird. Sounds subtle to me. Seriously? Man, we did it. Ichiban. <sighs> yeah, was Matsuo really a part of... The game I, I know they pronounced it a million times. I'm still gonna fuck it up, guys. Sorry. <laughs> Who cares? The problem solved. How did you pull it off? It was nothing special. Just did what you hired me to do. Look at you, serving some humble pie. Here's what I owe you. 5,000 yen, baby. Nah. Just total, bro. Sorry, I wish I could pay you more, but I still owe Hamako-san money, too. This is all I have to give. What's up? Just because we're homeless doesn't mean you can skimp out this hard on us. We risked our lives to cool it, Nanba. We helped them out. That's good enough. My life's only worth 2,500 yen, huh? No, your services. That's enough. Then let me give you some more work. If you come work at my place tomorrow, I'll give you 5,000 and we can call it even. Sup? Sounds good to me. You run a bar too, Hamako-san? I don't think so. Don't be a fool. You think I'd run a hole in the wall like this? Further down the river, there's a small row of restaurants. I'm down okay. there. Small restaurants, huh? Sounds tasty. I needed to clean one of them, and I won't accept anything less than sparkling. Got it. Got it. Thank you. Okay, see you tomorrow over there, then. Oh, sh oh, I should've asked. What are your names? Okay. Nanba. Oh, I'm... Kasuga. You got a first name? Okay. Ichiban. Ichiban Kasuga. I, w I swear it's not fake. <laughs> It's a nice name. Wear it proudly. Alright. Starting to get a couple of allies here. Oh, obtain Silver Safe Skeleton Key. This key will allow you to open all Silver Safe scattered throughout the city. Lovely. Oh, don't forget to eat, huh? You can eat and drink at. No. Oh. You can eat and drink at eating establishments. Indulging in, fa in this fashion will not only restore lost health, but also give you experience points. Certain combinations of items ordered will net you bonus experience points, so don't be afraid to mix and match. As, saying, as the saying goes, a good conscience is a continual feast. You know what? They're right. Let me see if I can find some restaurant. Well, I am going to a restaurant district, so... That does mean something. So, well, first let's go home. And for that, we fight these guys. Oh, and there's a shiny on the left. Let me beat these guys up. Get some experience points. Oh, wow, crap. Oh, you're calling for backup? Really? Well, good thing you missed, huh? Yeah, definitely gonna treat this like an RPG where, yeah, I'm not gonna skip most battles. Unless I need to. But let me see. Hmm. Well, that was a restaurant over there, so maybe I could head over there, because everything else is darkened, right? Yeah, so... That, but that's a bar though, they might only have alcohol. Well, let me go back and check. Especially since I'm here. Yo, homies! Burnout, bully, and capitalist punisher. Come on, bro. You're like falling behind. Oh, shit. Okay. Jeez. Really? 
so they can do that. Okay. So positioning is very important. I think that was an issue last time that happened. Haha, you missed. <laughs> Come on, kick me. Can't wait to unlock more moves, honestly. Okay, let's see. Uh... Ah, shit. Okay. Gotta beat these guys first. Got the same animation. Oh, yeah, that's right. I did unlock a special move. The Essence of Mayhem. <laughs> nice! Okay, that's pretty dope. Okay, that was cool. Namba came in with the fire assist. Lovely. It's probably gonna miss. Oh, backup has arrived. Well, I'll finish beating you up. And then I'll get my experience points from this guy. Yeah, because I kind of have been doing basic hits all day, haven't I? So, didn't really get a chance to use my specials. Nice. Anyway, back here. But I'm pretty sure all she got for me is... Oh, order recommendation. Oh. Well, what's on the menu? Oh, no, she got food. Never mind. You know what? Flip stores, HP, and MP. By ordering a certain combination of dishes, da, da, da. okay, pretty much what they told us earlier. I might as well get the recommended. Who's hungry? Me. Ah, tasty. Nice. Okay. Well, nice, full. Got the experience points. And let's go ahead and fight these guys and head on home. Threatening men. Let's see. I'll punch you in the face. Ah, oh, man. Job on the nice. Okay. Headbutt Barrage. Definitely can't wait to try that out. I'm kind of glad, like, even though Switch to turn base is still a little bit more interactive. You know? I, 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 I like when turn based RPGs are like that. Like, it, it adds to the formula, in my opinion. Okay. Head over here and probably knock these guys out because they're definitely going to want to fight it. Ah, shit. Well, let's try this headbutt barrage. Why not, right? No! Oh. Pitiful love. Okay. What did you do to me? Come on now. The hell? I mean, I feel like I didn't even need to press any buttons, cause yeah, that headbutt's pretty powerful. It's like the equivalent of a Mishima headbutt. I didn't know a bug could be so pretty. It's like it's painted silver. You got a real nice shine there, bud. Promise I'll take good care of you. Awesome. Okay. Oh, I guess I'll head back and, um, yeah. We'll take on the next day. 
Well, we've got a job to do tomorrow. Better make sure we don't okay. oversleep. Yeah, good night. Bye. The story is definitely starting to unravel here. I, I really want to see what happens, like, later on, and how just these group of people take down a group of Yakuza. Because this is definitely, like, embracing the goofiness of the Yakuza games, which you oftentimes find in the side missions. But, hey. yeah, these games should never be taken seriously, honestly. All right, let's head over to Hamako-san's restaurant. She said it was just down the river, as I recall. Okay, let's head down. Let's see. Down this way. Oh, shoot. Oh, man. I just ran around into stuff. Get out the way, bros. Hmm. Let me talk to you real quick. Oh, have you seen anyone with that kind of hair before? I'm sure you already know this, but you're in Yokohama. What are you trying to say? Relax, guys. I gotta start a cutscene. Oh, you're here. Yeah. Morning, ma'am. <laughs> Polite. Get up. We're closing for a few hours. Hey, lady. Hey, tell everyone up there to leave. What time is it? Let me sleep a bit more, Hamako-san. No. I'm having the place clean. I need everyone out till tonight. Sure. How many customers did you get yesterday? I don't know, at least five. Where were you? I'm exhausted. Small restaurant, huh? <laughs> Definitely a buffet. They cater to a very specific appetite. Damn, it's too damn to even dust this thing. Jeez. Hey, Jiban. Can you deal with these tissues? You do it. It's your job. Right? Bodily fluids really aren't my thing. Cut me some slack. But you're homeless. Don't you deal with that, like, all the time? You want to get paid or not? Would you rather say broke and homeless? No, but it doesn't mean I don't have standards. <sighs> don't be a diva. <laughs> what? Constitution's got to go! Attention, all Riverside business owners. Mm -hmm. This is Sota Kume, president of Bleach Japan's Yokohama chapter. So your case isn't exactly being sold when your shirt has BJ on it. I'm just saying. What's all the ragged? Oh, you don't know them? It's Bleach Japan. Prostitution's got to go! Get out of I, I know it stands for Bleach Japan, but again, BJ... Bleach Japan? Like, I can't take you seriously. You'll get 110 a jokes. profit group. What you'd call an NPO. Been around 15 years. Oh, okay. Our slogan is, Bleaching the Gray Zone's White. Oh. You know, some things fall into the gray area. Neither black nor white. Yeah. Like things that are technically illegal, but cops look the other way because they're victimless crimes. Yeah. They don't like that. They want to uh, crack down on all crime, whether it hurts someone or not. They want to uh, bleach the gray so that it's white. This town is just full of metaphors, huh? Yeah. The group's active all over the country now. Makes sense, considering their founder is Rio Aoki. And that is... Uh... He's the governor of Tokyo. Oh, oh she is. The one that was cleaning up the city with that, uh, Comrocho 3K plan. Wow. 
You actually got one right. <laughs> well, that plan made Alki real popular. The media adored him before he was governor, but they love him even more now. He resigned from Bleach Japan when he went into politics. Okay. But he still sings their praises. The young voters eat it up. I'm sure they okay, do. Okay, but why are they protesting right outside this building? This establishment here is registered as a restaurant. But you won't find a speck of food on the second floor. If you're lucky, a waitress might bring you some tea. <laughs> of course, you don't pay for that tea. You pay for something else. Let's just call it what it is. A brothel. Is it a Everybody BJ that I'm going to pay for? This is crime, pure and simple. Happening right out in the open for decades now. The women who work here have been brainwashed. They don't realize what they're getting into. I'm pretty sure they do, dude. And once they're in, they can't get out. We demand an end to this human tragedy. We demand it. I'm sure. Shut up, you whiners. These women are just working hard at their jobs. So working hard excuses a crime? You could learn from them. What right do you have to tell anyone how to live? Low key. Why so dishonest. Registering yourselves as a restaurant. I'll tell you why. It's because the truth is so terrible. No, it's because grown-ups do things they don't want to, to protect people. The only people you're protecting are your loan officer and your debt collectors. You ass. You ever consider why a woman might do this job? Because they have needs. Some are caring for their parents. Some have little kids. This is a way for them to support their family. She brings a point. Did you hear that? Not only are they criminals, they're raising children. Oh, Jesus Christ, that's all you heard. <laughs> that's all you heard, bro. Completely unfit parents. They are good parents. They keep their children happy and healthy, and that's what truly matters. Show me one then. Show me a child who's happy being raised by a whore. Actually, there's trying to understand. You just really not that part. There are I agree. Happy kids like that, are there? No child wants a prostitute for a mother. I never minded it. Huh? <laughs> oh yeah, 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 that's right. You got one right there. Here, take oh, these used tampons. Want to get rid of the trash? I got that right. Well, here it is. Get ready to catch. Wait, hold on. Wouldn't that be the check? Yeah. <laughs> That's hilarious. Not bad, Ichiban. Like, yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's one way of scaring off a crowd. But yeah. Here, take these used tampons and Lord knows what else. It's a brothel. What do you think? Use your imagination. What do you think these are? Come on. It's been two or three years since Bleach Japan started protesting in Ijinjo. <laughs> Now they're marching around almost every week. A lot of places have shut down thanks to them. Wow. But you're holding out for all the girls you've got here, right? Most of them don't have Japanese citizenship. Oh, they're children of grandchildren of illegal immigrants. If I shut down, where would they go? If we're being honest, they'd probably fall into some leeches who'd skim off most of their earnings. <laughs> so I'd do what I can to protect myself, you know? To protect them myself, you know? Sup? Thank you. Think you can keep it up? Who knows? I own the place. I'm just leasing the land. But I'm just leasing the land, yeah. If the owner told me to leave, that'd be the end of it. Hmm? Huh? Oh. Do I gotta fight these guys? You came back with more trash, fellas? True. You really did a number on us this afternoon. And you see if you think that was a number. Can't see nothing yet. You're still out protesting at this hour? Do you even have a permit? No, this isn't a protest. 
Blue Japan helps the down China in the week too. <laughs> Sometimes that means giving people like these guys our support. They were just hanging around our hamburger joint in front of the station. They've lived on cheap processed food their whole lives. They don't even know what a good meal tastes like. And that can stunt your growth. So we're trying to give them opportunity here. Tonight, Bleach Japan will cover the bill. Oh. oh yeah. What are you getting at? Oh, I just thought I'd make these boys feast on some high class cooking from this fine establishment. <sighs> so that's your angle? Uh. You really thought this through. Yo. Hold up, what's the point of taking them somewhere with no food? That's exactly what he wants to hear. <laughs> Literally. Thanks, Ichi. My permit says I run a restaurant, so I can't refuse. What are you gonna do then? Guess I'll feed them until the money runs out. <laughs> but I suppose my part is at an end here. I'll leave you to enjoy your meal. That is, if they have any food to serve. Looking forward to hearing all about it. Goodbye. Bye for now then. Oh. So, what's on the menu tonight, old lady? <laughs> I'm afraid all I've got are some stale crackers. 10,000 yen each. Eat up. Uh -huh. huh? You fucking with us, Granny? Oh, not a fan of crackers? I have some cookies, I think. They're a little moldy, though. You call that food? Well, I wouldn't eat it, but I think it's appropriate for the occasion. Boy. Hey, take us for fools. Hold on. Yes, actually. Calm down, fellas. We're perfectly allowed to, dis to be dissatisfied customers. Yeah, get us some real food. Hey. Oh, shut up. Stop complaining and get out of here. Oh, Namba is over here, you know, ready for battle. Because this is clearly where this is going. Oh, I see. You're saying this place doesn't have anything to eat. Guess what? Tell the bleach guy who gives us the money. Then, <laughs> you gotta pretend that wasn't your goal from the start. Yeah, it was kind of obvious, guys. The sob story was thin as paper. You guys got hired to mess with her business. So get out of here. Ow. Hey, the old guy's getting violent with us. You hit us first, so consider this self-defense. Beat the shit out of them. Well, this is gonna be fun. Lovely. Let's see. Do some gnarly breath. Lower their defense. Okay, I did not see him attack. Careful with that because they can interrupt my attack. Stricken with fear, huh? Okay. And you missed that one. I'll use that to defeat you, though. Yeah, you're done. Consumed by fear. Uh, as long as they don't give me a ghastly will, I really don't care. Not familiar with the attack ghastly will? Well, look it up. Alright, that is one of the reasons why I hate being stricken with fear in Persona. Outside of the other annoying fear uh, abilities. Okay, we're gonna tag team this Negro.
Hey. Flame on. <laughs> yeah. I got one more left, huh? I can't want to try this out. You gonna hand something over to me? Oh shoot. I mean, hell yeah. Love up, yeah. baby. Same for you. Pyro Belch. Ooh, that sounds interesting. I wonder what that consists of. Uh, how can an old guy be so strong? Uh, whatever. I'll see you around, Grandpa. <laughs> I'm only 42. Jeez. Why don't you use it to help your parents for once? Low key. I never thought Bleach Japan would resort to this type of thing. Bunch of dreamers. They really think they can bleach the gray zones? Come on. Honestly. They swagger around like they've got some noble purpose. But all they really want are donations. And let's Gets face it. Donations. What they're doing is just plain bullying. <sighs> Whatever happened to good manners? Yeah, it's 2019, so kind of started going out the window. Yeah, well, if it hasn't already. It's pretty late now. Let's go home. Sure. Sorry, you had to rescue me twice. Don't sweat it. Call us if you need cleaners again. <laughs> Low key. The protectors of Yokohama, huh? Mm -hmm. Two are homeless, right? Yeah. Well, here's a proposition. What if you just lived here, in one of the rooms upstairs? What? Huh? Really? I mean, that'd be a huge help. Do you even have a room to spare? Don't the girls need them to work in? Well, I'm not making the offer out of complete selflessness. Low key. I'm pretty sure we have to protect the place. Yeah, definitely, I'm pretty sure, of course, protection is needed. No, well, yeah, we're moving up, Inchiban. And Anba. If you live here, you get something called a right of residence, which would benefit me. Hmm. What's a right of residence? Yeah. It means that you can legally assert that you have the right to live somewhere. Okay. I don't get it. How would that benefit you? Well, I live in a different building. This is my business, but since I don't live here, I don't get that right of residence. Oh, okay. I think I get it. Mm-hmm. I'm leasing this building, you see? Okay. And if Bleach Japan really wants to get us evicted, they might pressure the owner of the property. Mm. I wouldn't put it past them. But, if someone here has right of residence, we can fight back. Once you have that right, the owner can't just evict you for no reason. Oh, so us living in the place would be a line of defense for you. Exactly. <laughs> you get it. Sounds like a great deal. But, you don't mind a couple bums living here? Well, you two are really my only choice of renters. The women who work here aren't citizens. So... I can't enter into a lease contract with them. Understood. But boys, it's not the only reason I'm making this offer. I'm impressed with what you two did. Sounds good to me. I don't mind being your live-in security guard. Oh, wonderful. Just promise you won't break the lease. I want your eyes on my shop for a long time. Until Bleach Japan finds someone else to buy. Sounds good to me. Thanks a lot. Nice. That all works out, doesn't it? <laughs> uh, 
Look, Ichiban. A roof. A real roof. <laughs> yeah, look, man. It's freaking amazing. This is our castle. A roof, four walls, uh, and a soft throne. <laughs> Actually, this throne's kind of damp. Nothing wrong with that, is there? I'm pretty sure it's not water. Ah, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Every time you drift off on that mat. I don't think I Always want to now. There. Then again, <laughs> I guess that's how you got us here in the first place. Hmm. Thank you, Ichiban. Come on. I should be the one thanking you. I'd be dead and rotting in a trash can if you didn't save me. Yeah. Are we about to go through your backstory? Hey. Why'd you quit nursing anyway? Ah oh, man. <laughs> you must have been good if you saved me. Truth is, I was smuggling drugs out of the hospital and selling them. Oh. The money was pretty good. Eventually I expanded to dealing drugs from overseas. Uh oh. But I got too big. And it all came crashing down. Mm, should have stayed small. License, if that wasn't obvious enough. Yeah, man. What were you thinking? Kind of a boneheaded move. What? You don't think I regret it? Okay, well, why not start over? The whole nurse thing is probably out, but you can apply your medical skills to something else. Right. Easier said than done. What about you? You got another job in mind? Um, uh, not really. I've been walking in someone else's footsteps for years, and now they're washed away. Mm. I don't know where to go now that I can't see them. I'm pretty lost. Oh, you talking about your patriarch? Yeah. Mm. A guy like you, you can find something. Yeah. What makes you so sure? I'm over 40, you know? Weren't you the one just telling me I could turn it all around and find something? Yeah, my bad. Sorry. Loki. <sighs> life is work. Life be life in. Hey, tell me this. What'd you want to be when you were a kid? Uh, oh. <laughs> you really want to know? Come on, don't build it up. Spit it out. Okay, I'll tell you. When I was a kid, all I wanted to be was a hero. Huh? A hero? What do you mean? You no, know, like Spider Man? You know, a hero who could save people. Like in Dragon Quest. <laughs> you know, like those Final Fantasy games, you know? Video game? <laughs> yeah, I want to be Cloud. Or Terra. How'd you do that? <laughs> or Squall. Dude, come on. Or Noctis, you know? Yeah. Well, well, yeah. <laughs> what? I can have a dream, can I? You don't have to laugh at it. A dream is what keeps you going. For me, anyway. Low key. Ichiban, you're right. Uh, uh, I am? You are. Uh, so I see you do it. Become a hero. Just like you wanted. Come on, I was just a dumb kid when I wanted that. It was silly. <laughs> it's not like you got any other goals right now. So why not go after the first one you had? Right. Live your life's dream. You're crazy. It's not like being a hero puts a roof over your head. Sure, it's not a job. But if the hero destroys lots of slimes in the game, he levels up fast, right? You see what I'm saying? That's Living true. up in life. That could work. Yeah. 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 Hell yeah. Why not become a hero at 40, right? Never too late. It ain't the best age to start grinding, but... <laughs> ain't too late till you're dead. I'm ready to level up. Let's start a brand new age of heroes! Yeah, I'm with you, Ichiban. Let's have a toast to our new era in our new home! Yeah, to the heroes of tomorrow! Cheers! Oh. Best buddies, drinking sake.
or whatever that is. Might be water. I don't know. Oh, 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 oh. Please, let me go. I swear, I'll tear that fucking bar down. Look, I know I messed up. I, I don't even want the money anymore. Just give me another chance. Uh -oh. How about this? I could kill the two guys who got in the way. I already know how to do it. Oh, you'd like that, yeah? You want them dead, don't you? Don't you? Wait, I didn't catch that. Don't speak Korean. I should have known not to rely on trash like you. Uh oh. Fascinating. Well, I guess we'll find out who those guys are in the next part, because they do seem pretty cool. We'll love to fight those guys. But please, please, please like, share, and subscribe. Just up, check us out at the Night Shift Bands on all podcasts and platforms, as well as the Perspectives Discussions. And please, please, please donate to us all links in the, des in the description below. It's me here, Professor Zach, and I will be back with another episode. You guys take care, stay hydrated, and be well. Have a good one. Bye-bye.